switching engine liners. Make sure your liner is clean. Make sure your liner bore or block is cleaned and all the debris is removed. Cleanliness is next to godliness in this situation. Liner should just drop in freely without any restriction, like thus. Check your standing height. Standing height normally is between three and five thou. You can pinch the liners down with a pair of set bolts. In this case, we are set the gauge to zero. Next step, get the large and small liner o-ring. These should now be covered in either oil, clean engine mineral oil, or uh, some hard marble blue if the uh, line uh, o-ring grooves are fitted. In this case the liner o-ring grooves in the block are very good and uh, no um, hard marble will be required. Oil at your liner o-rings. Do not use fairy liquid as the salts in the fairy liquid will attack the seals and ruin them. The big thick back one goes at the bottom, thin one at the top. Liner seals are correctly fitted. Remove all debris from the seat where the liner goes. the seals are sticking in place and then just wriggle it and then just keep wriggling it and push it in like this no need to hit it hammer it or do anything else to it it should just slide in if it doesn't slide in you haven't cleaned the bore correctly or removed any um, uh, excess anti-corrosion material that's on the liner you know, they really do need to be spotless. <laughs> 